you know, we have a, there was a really interesting paper that came out on liver autophagy and fatty liver disease. You know, we used to think fatty liver was a function of high fructose corn syrup consumption, or this is non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, yeah, right. which, which, you know, the metabolism of alcohol and non-alcohol, the, the metabolism is very similar. It still results in a fatty liver, but you consume too much high fructose corn syrup and it starts to look like alcohol in your liver. Well, what we're starting to see is that as you upregulate liver autophagy, it helps manage fatty liver disease and reverse it to a certain degree. So, you know, is is fatty liver, no one's endorsing high fructose corn syrup, don't get me wrong, but is the real problem the lack of a molecule that facilitates that autophagy process in the liver that lets you metabolize those lipids in the liver so they don't start to build up? Well, we've got a nice, this is, you know, several of the doctors we work with have said, you know, when they have someone who presents with non-alcoholic fatty liver, they don't have a lot of tools to use with that individual. Well, most of them have gone to high dose uh, spermidine supplementation and have been very happy with the results.